National Geographic show the incredible Dr. Paul centers around Dutch American veterinarian Dr. Paul, who caters to the needs of farmers in Michigan. Joining the Dr. Paul is his wife Diane Paul and son Charles Paul. They successfully run Paul Veterinary Service. The Paul family has been a constant presence on the show. However, over the years, so many big names and loved veterinarians have left Dr. Paul. Most recent departures were Dr. Emily Thomas and her husband Tony in 2019. The new aspiring vet, Dr. Nicole Arce, as she takes over the vac control, it has fueled the speculation Dr. Brenda Gedenberger might as well be heading exit doors. A resident of Eaton Rapids, Michigan, Dr. Brenda has been working for Dr. Paul for nearly 27 years. The numbers alone are enough to prove her commitment to her veterinary job and Dr. Paul. Although when she first started in 1992, she found a lack of faith among farmers being the only female veterinarian around the area. Eventually, her hard work and skill helped win over. Dr. Brenda is the last woman standing as it seems. Since she began on the incredible Dr. Paul in 2011, her co-vet Dr. Elizabeth Kramer, Dr. Sandra Wisnowski and now Dr. Emily has left the show. Meanwhile, Dr. Brenda has no plans to leave Paul Veterinary Service and the show. Dr. Brenda currently features on the 16th season of Dr. Paul. If you are curious more about Dr. Brenda, here are some interesting facts. Dr. Brenda is currently 53 years old. She celebrated her 53rd birthday on February 23. Dr. Brenda loves large animals, further justified by the fact she owns ox as a pet. When it comes to personal life, she does not share much. Even we cannot tell whether or not she's married and let alone her children. Dr. Brenda literally grew up on a dairy farm taking care of cows and other animals. This is all updates on Dr. Brenda Gredenberger. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you loved it. See you guys on next video.